<laughs> Who's this? Mm, may not recognize him, but you recognize his alter ego. Well, that's the alter ego, but this is the real person. Yeah, Superman. It's a lovely use of, of acetate. It's a transparent substance which you can draw on, and when you put things behind it, all sorts of magic happens. There is Clock Kent, wasn't he? His alter ego. It's an old looking businessman, and turns into Superman just by sliding the card down and cutting out part of the um, design work. Very nice transformation, that. So, using acetate and um, cardstock, you get some very, very nice and pleasing effects. And some of my favourites, when I've got two more, three more here, which are all greeting cards, this was called a, this was called slider cards, this one's here. But here's one of them, which I think is absolutely charming. Let's have a go with him. So, man looking out of a window, looking a little bit sort of um, mournful, and when you slide the thing back, magic, magic, magic. Yellow comes into the sunroom. Oh, look at that smile suddenly appears. Any more? Oh, yes, an extra message as well. That's very nice. And then when you close it again, it goes back to the first state. Oh, it's just done by having a, a card going over. So some of the print is on the front surface, which is acetate, and some of it's on the back surface, which only appears when you've taken away the, um, the slider card, which is obscuring it. It's a very nice bit of design work. Ooh, pretty in Britain, that one. And this is the second one. These are both about sort of 30, 40 years old, I think it is. So this is a, a little bird. Somehow he's able to pick up a watering can. That's pretty clever, isn't it? He's going to water the flowers. What are those stalky things? Well, they have got buds in them, but they don't appear until he starts pulling back. And then, oh, yes, tulips. But each of them is shaped like a heart. That's a very nice bit of artwork, all the way up to the end. It doesn't come off at the end either, so let's push him back again. He's now unwatering the grass. Aren't they beautiful? Very nice design, these. And there's one more, which is um, funny because it goes the wrong way, as it were. It's, um, it's a clown, in all black and white. But if I pull this bit down, and try to pull the other bit up, see what happens. It turns into a wonderful... Fully technical clown. What's going on there? Well, this is in two layers, and in the middle of the card there is a little bit that sort of blanks it out. And when it slips either side of that, it's got to go either side of that, you get this black and white version of this. But it has to be put in that special way to make it work. So there's some very nice thoughts. This is really a magic trick, this one, actually. But anyway, some very nice thoughts have gone into these slider cards involving acetates and then cardstock and you can make some of it yourself at home because you can buy acetate sheets and photocopy them as well so i've got some lovely effects of that something to look out for and if you can come up with something like this well you're really doing something perhaps you better go into business <laughs>